The next question is at motion number 14111, in the name of Mark Griffin, on the British Sign Language Scotland Bill be agreed to. Are we all agreed? Yes. Yes. Wow, I can't explain. It's, it's fantastic. And I think particularly really fantastic for, for children who are born deaf, because I think it gives them the opportunity that they really ought to, to have and should have had. And I think the vote, the passing of this, this bill is, I mean, when it happened, I felt really quite overwhelmed, you know, because it's just, it's been such a long sort of battle and it's finally, finally over and I'm hugely excited. It's been a very emotional day. Um, and it all dates back to the conference in Milan where sign language was banned and oral education uh, was enforced upon deaf children for many, many years. And finally, we now have some legislation that recognises BSL. And I'm really pleased because I think it will really impact on the future of deaf children and their progress. It means an awful lot. In my family, two generations ago, I uh, had four deaf uh, relatives. And my great-great-uncle and aunt at that time were attending a, a deaf school at Donaldson's. And in 1880, at Milan, there was a conference that banned use of sign language in education when they were at school. And now, I'm here, I'm deaf myself, and I'm here when that decision is reversed by the Scottish Parliament. And uh, it's, it's had a massive emotional impact on me. Um, I think it will make life a lot more open for deaf people. I mean, we've traditionally experienced an awful lot of barriers to our lives. Well, when the vote was, uh, was uh, made, it made me very emotional, hugely proud, I think, but very emotional because this is such an important day for the deaf community uh, in, in Scotland, in Britain and in the world. And I feel hugely excited because I think the future uh, of young deaf people and their education could change as a result of this bill. And I think uh, there have been traditionally a lot of barriers to young uh, people within education and I think those barriers could now be removed. The motion is therefore agreed to. <laughs> and the British Sign Language Scotland Bill is passed. <laughs>